Wow. All right, Virgo, this is a powerful week. Yeah, you got some chaotic energy around you, strong new beginnings, and a question that someone may have. I'll see if it's a yes or no. Um, possibly a no. All right. Um, it's not very clear, so I can't say exactly. So I'm going to say maybe. All right. Um, kind of a chaotic energy, scattered energy, but there is, you know, there's things coming at you. And this to me is divine detours. This is the universe redirecting you and that's for positive, uh, you know. Um, so don't be stuck on plans. Of course, it is that time of the unexpected too. It's like, um, you know, sometimes you have a plan and the universe just looks at you and says, hey, yeah, right, you know, or <laughs> there's some detours because sometimes we just have to go through some experiences. So I do, you need to trust um, that it's the right thing, okay? Because it's very powerful and, you know, it's kind of common, this um, scattered energy. We are going through a Mercury retrograde and I did post that video last week so you can... Um, Check that out. It's on my YouTube channel. You could be dealing with a lot of energies. For a lot of you, this is a lot of thoughts of people too um, or situations. And it doesn't always necessarily mean that it's right. Um, it's just thoughts. I am seeing here you could be dealing with an Aquarius. Could be dealing with a Cancer. You may feel like There's too much energy to be put with these people or that, or that you've been taken advantage of somehow, but it's more of a thought. Um, so try to see why you feel that way, because I don't feel it's, you know, there's that feeling, but then, you know what I mean? Now, this also indicates here, don't assume anything without knowing the facts and figures, or you're just rehashing some things in your head. Um, you have a strong new beginning now. You have a rebirth. So there is also this energy of forgiveness and moving forward. Okay? Not a bad week. The week could end on a bittersweet note for some of you. It's our end of a stress. <laughs> but um, for some of you, you're holding on to pains or this one's done me wrong or this hasn't been going good. You have to stay um, positive or shut the door to that because it's kind of holding you back, okay? We don't realize that sometimes we are our own worst enemies and we do self-sabotage ourselves just through thoughts, okay? I do see beautiful energy here. Some of you, some Virgos here are definitely, you're taking your power back. You're moving forward with confidence. You got victory, success, no matter what, doing well. This could be, um, hey, you did a really good job at work or a social group that really is like your, um, they're like Team Virgo. Team Virgo is what I'm hearing here. Really good, okay? You kind of um, <clears throat> sit in your hands, <clears throat> sitting on your hands about something, indecisive. And this could be with love, okay? So there is some intense energy here with matters of the heart as well. I feel it's trust issues or you got some decision to make, okay? So definitely um, seeing that kind of energy. Um, I do see lessons learned. This is um, reviewing the past, what went wrong, what didn't, and moving forward. All right, you got creative solutions. For some of you, you just have to be patient, okay? There's lessons that you're learning for good or for, you know, for some of you, it's like, it's a repeat. For some of you, this is, you learn, you're moving forward, and this is um, a beautiful energy. You're right where you're supposed to be. I want to say you're on the right path though, but you have to be a little patient, okay? Someone that already you're connected to somehow may come in and help you out somehow. Um, this is either delegating some of your responsibilities or maybe they may um, take off some kind of a burden for you, offer you some kind of good advice for health or for business. And with finances, so I do see that someone could be, you could be taking care of someone if someone's taking care of you, so I do like that energy too. Very nurturing, nice, kind energy is showing up here too, so I do like that. Um, I do feel that um, for some of you, it's like starting over again. It's a new clean slate, new beginning, um, more positivity, positive thinking, but for some of you, you're holding some resentment. There is some anger, maybe some jealousy around you too, but um, 
it's something to kind of soul search about too so i do feel that energy either way i see a healing energy beautiful healing energy as well focus this week too because you could be accident prone because you're just overthinking some things too okay i do feel for some of you there could be an opportunity to um this could be dealing with legalities um signing something i see a pen and i see that that's like signing some kind of documents in that but for some of you you know it is a period where we shouldn't be doing that but if you have to you know we can't stop life make sure that you are double checking everything and what you're getting into so i do see that now for some of you this is something that has been you've been holding off to make something official and you actually and may work out for you maybe this has happened in other mercury retrogrades and now it's a time to stop that procrastinating and sign something off and get off your chest and just move forward 